what is going on Tech Junkies? My name is JD and today we're going to be doing an unboxing and review of this beautiful LG Mini Hi-Fi System CM4550 speaker system. Oh wait, I gotta lose the hat. That's like unbox therapy. So I chose this thing because it's a nice red and black theme over here. So uh, let's do this. I would show you a top-down view, but it's kind of boring because it's a bunch of styrofoam, so we're going to take the things out, and I'll show you that way. All right. We got, uh, it looks like some speaker wire, with some information packet, and some off-brand batteries, but that's okay. At least it came with batteries. Got a nice remote. It's a surprisingly nice remote. Oh, this looks like the head unit. Oh, 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 oh you are... Sexy 700 watt RMS, so that's like the normal wattage it usually uses, I believe. It's got like a carbon fiber finish on top of it as well, and it's nice and light. It's actually not too heavy, so that's that's really cool. All right, what do we got here? Okay, I think these are two satellites. It's super, super sexy. Look at this thing. I love this red ring in the middle. That is so cool. Oh, and the carbon fiber finish. LG did a really good job at making this look very nice. I don't know how it sounds just yet, but it it looks awesome. Yep, we got the other satellite speaker right here. And I have no idea where I put my knife. Ah, here it is. All right. This is my favorite part, the subwoofer. <laughs> Look at the size of this thing. Man. That is, that is sexy. That is a sexy looking cone in there. That red ring, I can't get over the red ring. That is beautiful. Ah, oh, unboxing is truly an experience. It really is. Put this down here. And also, keep in mind, this is the 2015 version, I believe. If it's not, then I'm completely wrong. But I don't really care about the year. I just care about the sound quality. So let's see how this thing sounds, shall we? So I got a chance to extensively test out the speaker system. And I still have more testing to do with it. But I went through the EQ on the system itself, the remote it came with, and also the phone. And I tested it through auxiliary, USB, and also Bluetooth because they all have different sound profile qualities. And overall, I thought it was great. The only thing lacking really was the bass. I feel like it can, get, it can give more power to the bass, but it's just not doing it. It's evenly dispersing it throughout all the speakers. Now, the sound system doesn't have to have overpowering bass. It's actually a very well-balanced sound system. And I appreciate that. I just personally have a preference towards more bass and that can always be adjusted down the line by getting another subwoofer and attaching it via the head unit. So that's always an option, but for $170 to $150, this is a great, great system to have especially for the type of sound quality you get out of the speakers. Now, as I said earlier, LG did a great job designing this speaker system. The carbon fiber finish on the black and the red cones is an absolute masterpiece. I love it and it perfectly matches the black and red theme. Now, it's also worth mentioning that the red backlight behind the volume knob is very nice at a touch and completes the red and black theme to the rest of the sound system. Now on the interface it has two USB ports including a record. It also has an auto DJ button which mixes your music for you and a bass blast button that increases the bass and also a Latin EQ button which is a little different than usual but they have the normal equalizer on the remote itself. The head unit of course includes the stop, play, and skip buttons, and it also has USB, CD, 
auxiliary and radio inputs for the sound system. And this is the speaker panel on the back of the head unit that has the positive and negative wires marked individually, which is really nice and an easy to use connector for the subwoofer as well. I gotta say the installation was pretty easy on this one. And here is the antenna and auxiliary in. The antenna is included with this package and there's two auxiliary ports. There's a single line in on the front of the head unit and there's the red and white on the back of the head unit. It also features a multi Bluetooth system where multiple devices can connect to the speakers and control the audio. I haven't tried this out and I'm a little curious as how this is going to work out between people who want to listen to different music. And this is also the remote for the sound system. It's actually pretty responsive and very good looking and has some advanced features that's not available on the head unit itself. Now overall, this is a very well rounded sound system. I wish there was a little bit more customization for the sound settings but there's really not much else I can ask for for a $150 to $170 sound system. So overall, sounds great, has a lot included with the package, and I'm gonna give this the official TSG certification. So this is definitely certified, guys. All right, well, I hope you guys enjoyed that video and um, found this informative, entertaining, and uh, if you want uh, the speaker system, it's gonna be down in the description below. Um, it's a great speaker system. And I think I've still got a little more toying around to do with it to really get its full settings and really understand everything. Uh, there's going to be more unboxing and review videos for new tech coming on the way that I want to show you guys. If you guys want to see more videos like this and uh, you want to see more stuff related to tech, reviews, unboxings, and uh, all around PC knowledge and everything in between, consider subscribing. If this is your passion, this is my passion, so let's share it together. All right, so thank you to the tech junkies watching this video, and uh, I will catch you guys next time.